Oh yeah, so we're now gonna go up to the new warehouse. Nice new shiny warehouse. Well, it's not. You'll see what I mean when I get there. To go pick up the keys. There was a guy in there before this far, uh, six months in arrears and he left loads of stuff there but took all the good bits so we've got to go see what it looks like i guess i haven't been in there i look through the windows it doesn't look great um let's go i'll meet you up there alex see you a bit, mate. oh my fucking god shit but there's a whole lot to clear up Jeez. So I've got to clear all of this out before we can even do anything. I've ordered a skip, but it's not going to be enough. Got the keys, skip's coming tomorrow. Um, yeah, there's a lot to do. Did it come up? Smooth. I thought it was going to fall down, it didn't. Yo! Oh no! Should I do it? You see his hands? Can I give one back? You can't follow you up. Just don't fucking do it at us though. Pussy. No! <laughs> <laughs> I'm now home, uh, we've been to the new warehouse. It's an absolute pit. We're gonna crack on tomorrow and get it finished because we get the skips delivered. Um, there's a lot of work on our hands, but it has a lot of potential. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be a long run, and we've got about a month until we've got to get out of our old premises. So, uh, you just have to watch to see what it turns out like. <sighs> it's Thursday morning, the day after getting the keys for the warehouse. Um, my granddad just called me, it's half eight, well, 8.55. He called me and said, I thought he was gonna be here at half eight. But my granddad, he came up yesterday and uh, he loves his scrap metal and his wood. So I offered him to take whatever he wants out of the warehouse and he can take it home and build another shed. He's got about nine sheds in his tiny garden. But first, I've gotta go fill up the GTR back to his natural watering hole, his favorite place to go. Um, and then we're gonna get in the warehouse, give granddad a hand to load up his car, so let's go see Grandad, shall we? Hello, sir. So I've been away all day. Uh, my granddad and mother have been here cleaning up, have had some pictures, and they have done an outstanding job. So let's go in, have a look. Damn. Hello, mother. Fucking you know. hell. What do you think? Have a good job, isn't it? This has now been taken down. Yeah, and then we've got to take this whole thing out um, to get rid of it, to open the space up. And that is day two done. Um, that's a massive difference to what it was. Um, keeping a few bits over there. All oh, that's been taken down, stacked up over there. We've still got a lot to do. We've got to paint the ceiling, paint the floor, paint the walls. And we've still got to design something as well, come up with some ideas of what we want where, how we want it. Cars are going to go in that corner down there, I think. We'll have a nice photo area for cars down there. We need somewhere for new business. Me and mine, James's new business, but I don't know where that's all going to go. So we're getting there. Day two, done. Back tomorrow because we've got to sort a of car out that is going live Monday. Uh, yeah, we'll get some more done tomorrow. Ciao. We are back in the warehouse today, excuse the mess. We're in the process of moving, as you've seen. Um, Linda's chatting to her mum in the background. We just got a load of deliveries come through, because we've got a massive monitor comp going up. There's a massive Lego comp, which we thought was built. All of that up there. Uh, um, so I thought we thought all the Lego was here. Turns out it's not. Um, and we just got some more deliveries. This is really cool, the Lego Bowser. I think I'm gonna keep one to build in the warehouse. Got a load of Lego Star Wars bits, some Playstations. Monitors are coming in, and then we've got all of them down there. So Alex is currently doing some unboxings. What's, oh, that's for the bundle. Nice, very nice. Okay, and we've got to transport all this over to the new warehouse. All stock. 
What an absolute nightmare. The internet's gone down at uh, this warehouse. I'm now going to take the Focus ST up to the new warehouse because we're going to do some bits on it today. Uh, so I'll see you at the warehouse. Now back in the warehouse, um, Cam and Alex are going to make their way up here soon because we've got to do some bits on the, uh, the ST. But until then, I'm going to start chucking the rest of that lot in the skip. Um, Cam and Alex are both here, under the car. How are you getting on, Alex? Yeah, they're going out of the way, we're going to leave them on this. Ah, that's good then. They're getting the exhaust on. Uh, we've got the splitter. Splitter's somewhere. Um, got a few bits to chuck on it. They'll be going live on Monday. I have nearly cleaned the pile. It's all nearly gone, thank Christ. Um, and then it'll be on to taking this down. Um, sweaty old jobs. Hi. Hello. What's the matter, mate? I just ripped the top off my battery. Oh, Luke's been using it as a hammer. Luke owes me a new 5 amp hour DeWalt battery, pop that. Well, 500 quid! No, 5 amp hour. Because Luke, without his hat on? Rude. Today's just getting better and better. Yeah, today's just going wrong, isn't it? Everything's broken. I am ripping out for fucking all. That would be a bad idea. Don't do that, mate. Is this the right way to do it or the Luke Moore way to do it? No, this is the right way. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. He's now got his first splinter. Then this is a rope thing. Oh. Yeah. Splinter? Oh, don't show the camera this. We'll get demonetized. <laughs> Lovely makeshift plaster there, mate. Well. You need to get them big screws out. Well, that's not going to work. I'm going to have to wait until we get a ladder. And there's a lot of panels to do. The amount of wood. And that's all screws, man. And that is us done for the day. Car done. All done, ready to go live on Monday. Looks really good. Thank you to Cameron and Alex. The rest of it will hopefully come down uh, either this weekend or next week. See you when I'm next dinner, I guess. Bye! Morning, it's Sunday. Um, now we're gonna head to the new warehouse and me and Alex are gonna start cracking on taking down that building. Alex is an absolute legend for coming in on a Sunday. Um, but first I'm gonna quickly nip to M&S to get some food, both because there's nothing around the new warehouse. Um, so we're gonna have to have a packed lunch every day. I'm gonna get some food and then we're heading to the warehouse. Let's go. Made it to the warehouse. Uh, Alex isn't here yet, but I'm gonna start cracking on. I'm gonna start taking these bits off up here, the white bits left up here, and then we're gonna crack on with the roof. And then all of the rest will come down. But as you saw, the roof is littered with wood. So there's gonna be loads of screws. Uh, it's gonna be fun-ish. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get cracking on. We found a way how to get the roof off. No, I'll let you be the judge. He forced me to do it. <laughs> I said I would do it actually. And now uh, you're like, hey, I'm lighter, so. Lighter? No, you're not. I'm not like three pounds lighter than you. No. I've got to turn the audio on. Ah! Sorry. Add sound effects of <laughs> and heroic men screaming because I didn't scream. I don't know. Oh, no, we're attached. Yeah. Holy fucking hell! No, we're not. <laughs> That's gonna go. The bomb's gonna go. Walking out. Oh my god. Cool Help! I have a feeling it's going to go wrong. But... Ready? Ready? Oh. Ready? Oh. You're fucking joking. Just give it a crack. Mate, this really wants to go. Ready? Three, two, one.
And that is the room down. There's a shit ton of timber there. But me and Alex are now heading home because I'm done for today. I'm tired and I need food. I don't know what we're gonna do with this, but we're gonna sell it, get it sold, get someone to come pick it up and dismantle it. And uh, then start painting, I guess. Um, but until tomorrow.